Successful internet marketing is not as difficult as you think. Many might think that successful internet marketing can only be accomplished by those with technical backgrounds who have had years of online experience. In light of that, many find it easier to just stick to the immediate task at hand without rustling their own feathers. But I have found that keeping your nose to the grindstone isn't always a good thing, especially when you are talking about the business of marketing someone else's business. I don't care if you are working for a conventional employer or a network marketing company or anyone in between. Focusing solely on their company is a recipe for long-term financial mediocrity at best and disaster at worst. I have been in the internet marketing game for 10 years now and one thing I have come to realize is that you must stand out in order to rise up. This is what does not stand out. Replicated websites me too portfolios hiding behind your products or services weighted down empty promises of making people overnight millionaires I wonder why internet marketers do not dare to be different. Why don't they come out on a limb and show what makes them unique and special instead of recycled and ho-hum? If you are tired of the merry-go-round and want to learn how to step out on faith, step up to the plate, and step into your truest destiny, then I encourage you to look deeper. If you want to be a successful internet marketer, then you only have to shift your vision, look beyond your MLM or network marketing business. Look past the pills and the potions you are peddling. Take your nose off of the grindstone, step back and do a more thorough assessment of what you can bring to the marketplace. I bet you are limiting yourself and that you have more assets than you've previously given yourself credit for. Here are some great questions to ask yourself. 1. What are you good at? 2. What are you not so good at but are willing to learn? 3. What simple or major problems have you overcome in the business world that you can now turn around and help others navigate? 4. What about personal challenges? What have you survived that now positions you to give hope to others? Now, asking these questions is just the beginning of your journey to building a personal business that you own and can take pride in. One that fully reflects more of what you can bring to the table, one that has more of your personal signature on it and testifies more to who you are and what you are made of. You are more than a bottle of juice, a cosmetic case, or a telecom service, stop hiding behind your products and come into the marvelous light so we can see you better. Check out my profile to find more strategies on successful internet marketing. Remember, when you operate from the right base, then the journey can be as fulfilling for you as it is for those who you help. To your good fortune, Coach Kim.